What's up everyone, welcome back to I Love The Sun 2. This is like the millionth time I've recorded this already. I'm just going to get to zoom right. I'm using the, the uh, joypad for, for the first time in ages, so uh, forgive me if I'm a bit rubbish. But I'm still going to try and do it without using any meds. So yes, there's going to be an enemy near, so... It takes, sometimes it takes a while to turn, so uh, you can use that to your advantage. But just don't let him hit you, so all you've got to do is... If, if he hits you, then you're... There we have it. So right now, yes. Don't know why she was messing about there. And why the controls automatically changed on me. Alright. Oh, I had it, I had it set up properly during the practice when. Jump in via. Stop lagging, warriors. I'm recording this off a new uh, laptop, so uh, don't be surprised if the picture's all not perfect. But anyway, pull up here and grab this shotgun ammo. Actually, you don't need to do this. But I'm not it's just hop into the water this way. You save a bit of fall damage by doing it this way. I think if you fall from any other way, you will take a bit of damage. <laughs> now this tail is not very difficult to get through. But I'm gonna make it hard for myself and say I'm not gonna use any of the meds. I'm still gonna pick them all up, but I, I might miss one or two, but you know. I always miss a few minute pickups. As long as, as long as I get through the game with all secrets, it's fine. So, go back your gun again, and I'm going to save because this pick kills me in last time I played. There's going to be two enemies. One of them, and there's also going to be one of these weird hovel things. Are you coming? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Whatever. Yes. Sometimes you can hit, you can come with seven, and sometimes it takes ages. I'll just fire twelve shots at him, and then just be like, goodbye. So here, you just want to sprint. Oh, yeah, to the end. You see those traps are there, but let's not bother with them just yet. Anyway, let's just come in here. And grab a pickup. 
So this is it's just one pickup for crossbow bolts. So yes, once you've got them, come out here and pull out and come up here because it's the only place where you can grab the ladder. Be careful of the blades or the knives or whatever you want to say. Come on, come on, Crafty. So once they're not actually that difficult to avoid. Actually, you don't even need to use the rest of them. Just drop down and shimmy under the rest of them. And now this place has been successfully avoided. So this took good, I say. I'm fixing to uh, do some more traps here in just a sec. Fixing. What could the game face would say? So thankfully those traps have shut up now, so uh Progress. Yeah, I'll jump back with a roll. And this room is pretty scary. So you want to, first of all you wanna wait for this axe to swing in front of you. So run and try and land just in front. Actually, I don't think this power hit you. This is the one where you've got to be careful. You actually want to wait for it to go and wait for the flame to be away, but don't run too fast and like that. Take a step back. No, it's too far. Run, just run. And this time, oh god, that was awful. I can do better than that. So there's no. It's alright. This one, you actually want to be angled a bit because you want to run straight to here. Because this is where we're going to go to now. Took a bit of damage there, but that's fine, honestly. You really don't need to worry about your life. Because these levels are so, are so short. So I'm having trouble with my, my uh, words today. These levels are so short that they'll be over before you even need to use a medi. Most of the time, you might you might have to use one or two if, you've, uh, if you're new to this game. But a female has never hurt anyone. So come up here and you can see that this will take you back to where we started. So now I'm just pointing this out. If you ever have trouble and you do need to get back to this place, you can jump from here from over there to over here. We can just get back really quickly without having to go through all that rubbish again. But anyway, let's just do what we came in here to do. Push this button. And look up there. We're going to go there in just a bit. But that's not where we're going to go now. We're going to have to leave that for just a bit. Notification. Just, just hand me that something is happening. Oh well. 
I'm not, I'm not going to read it just yet. can be a bit tricky because it's flames and the things but that's not that bad never flame one right here just to make it a bit harder as soon as the flame goes out you want to run into the store and that's the end of it you may think there's going to be a bowl trap there but there isn't so don't worry this is another place where you may think there could be one but no but this is what gets me so wait for him to uh, fire a little bit later four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12. Yes! And he dropped this large muddy pack. Ta da! I love where it shows what you pick up on the screen. I hate those TLDs that have taken that feature out. I'll just save it while well, I'll just so well. Damn. These traps are quite irritating. Up against the wall, side down. Well, it's a bit of damage, but I got through it. Two more. Yes. I'm going to save it because I'm burnt. There we go. That wasn't that bad now, was it? So now... Where am I going? Through here, I thought, I thought I'd seen something. I believe there is... I might be wrong about this, but... Because... One... Yes, that's right, there's some shotgun ammo. Right here. And if this goes well, which it will do because this is a video that I did for Awfully at, yeah. pull up here. You'll find. The hand of Orion. So what you're going to do this is we're going to place it Unfortunately you can't jump from here to there But you can jump from there to here which is a bit weird So you see you may have seen where we're placing this We did see the area earlier, I didn't point it out but it's there So the best way to see this is just to up down and also I believe I missed a pick up I believe I'm not sure about this but I'm gonna check while I'm here no, there's nothing
missed the nether. I think. There is actually one up there, yeah, that's what I was right. See, I know where things are. Right, let's go and get game. Well, that's weird. One sec. So let's carry on now. So let's just get my thing all sorted up. So I got I think I uh it's better. Basically my when my battery runs low it, it my it goes into battery my laptop goes into battery saver mode and that's what just happened there. And when it's in that mode everything gets all laggy. So sorry about that. Issue is now solved. Pull up. Come up here. Did I grab a shotgun right there? Yes, I did. So yes, you've come up here, this is where we fell into the water earlier, but let's head over to this place now. Level Ryan. So that is where we're going to head to. Now, also, if you want some uh, sh more shotgun ammo, let's have a small muddy pack. And you almost get that. So I knew I'd get something wrong. My bad. So, yes. Oops. See you in a minute. So guys, I'm back at this spot, so let's just be careful. There we go. Now you see I've got very little health left. That is actually a first for me. I lost it all at that one part with the can open trap. Or the circle blade, whatever the hell you call it. So let's just jump, jump, be very careful, we can see where we have to go. Placing the uh, staff hand level one, I think it was. Opens up. <coughs> this. Sorry about that. So this is where you gotta place the night sky gem. Well, one of them anyway. open and actually them doors uh, are the ones that we need to end this level so I'm going to save real quick because my health is so low but I want to try something here if it doesn't work I'm going to have to go to the water yes so if you just go down 
and we just go to grab but don't actually grab and that's going to be the end of this video guys so take it easy goodbye